Calm down, Alex. You're fine. You're fine. Whatever that bottle made her think of, it really messed her up. I wonder if I could help her the same way I helped Ethan. I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her. Love that Gabe was going to be part of a LARP would have been fun to see. I wonder how she's really holding up. One of the happiest memories I have. Thanks, Gabe. Foosball champion? Why would that make her so sad? Living off these is not great, but it's better than leaving the apartment. Same. Feels like a million years since that day with Gabe. Hasn't even been a week. Hey, Shushu. Thanks for sticking around. Getting dressed shouldn't be so hard. And yet... Thanks, Jed. Now I can find out what's really going on with Steph. Damn it, fucking overpowered blue meteor. Aww, <laughs> is your controller broken too? We're playing until I win. Then I'll be crashing here tonight. What are they called again? Don't shit on my yard! They're amazing! Their guitarist has one arm! Badass! <laughs> Dude, give it up. I already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait, hear me out. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. You just lost 50 bucks. Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm not taking it. I move to Denver next week. You what? Ladies and gentlemen, presenting your new foosball champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. I can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could have beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. Bullshit. I think I know enough to help her now. Still can't believe he's gone. Yep. He's the whole reason I'm still... I'm sorry, Alex. Don't mind me. How about a quick match? Did Gabe tell you we played? I just had a hunch. 
Yeah? Well, you're right. I don't really think it's a great time. Fine. First to five points? If you say so. So, how often did you and Gabe play? It was one of our favorite games. You must be pretty good then. Mm-hmm. You were in a band, right? Yeah. What'd you play? Drums. How, uh, how long did you play with them? <sighs> Too long. Gotcha. Five points! That's game! Yep. Big shocker. Oh, hey, at least you played your best. I mean, that obviously wasn't my best. No, I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. It requires skill, timing, and the will to be a champion. Oh, is that how it is? Okay, okay. Joking aside, Playing this stupid game with you is exactly what I need right now. You're on. <laughs> I'm actually trying this time, so you better focus. I am focusing. Good. Wouldn't want you to get distracted or anything. Certainly not. Greatest Northwest band of all time, go. <laughs> Are you trying to distract me? Oh, of course not. Slater Kinney, if you were wondering. Oh, yes! 
Let's do one more game. I don't know. Oh, come on. You know Gabe would never let a tie stand. Well, then it's settled. <laughs> this is it. For all the marbles. So many marbles. Definitely the kind of game you want to focus on, no matter what happens. Totally. Hey, so are you into girls or what? <laughs> yeah. Girls are pretty rad, right? Especially girls that play foosball and host radio stations and wear beanies. Like it's a religion. <laughs> Sounds like a winning combo. This is what? How convinced were you that that was going to work? From one to ten. <laughs> like a three. Well, that's more than... Oh, oh fucking finally! <laughs> The house of Chen crumbles at last! <laughs> Good game. Thank you. You're a much better loser than Gabe. That's no fun. Sorry to spoil the victory. It's kind of crazy that you knew exactly what would cheer me up. Don't give me too much credit. I'm the one who really needed it. So, what are you gonna do now? What do you mean? That shit with Mac, he's clearly lying, right? I'm not sure what Mac's deal is. His story doesn't add up. Yeah. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night. For myself and for Gabe. I've got your back. No matter what. Thank you means a lot. I should head back to work. Cool. Bye. Bye. I know Gabe made that call, but did Mac really let the blast go off just to get back at him? I never got to see bartender Gabe in action, but he left some pretty big shoes to fill. Getting dressed shouldn't be so hard, and yet... I could probably use a little more practice. Would have been fun to see Gabe crush some sweet powder. Or whatever, snowboarders. <laughs> you served him well. At least I got to have a few good moments. One of the happiest memories I have. Thanks, Gabe. Gabe really meant the world to Steph. Not much to toast at the moment. The kind of person who got that worked up over a college essay could be capable of almost anything. I just got him back. 
How can he be gone? The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. We should have gotten so many more sunsets. I'll toss those soon, I swear. I thought this was gonna be the one, finally. Despite all the disappointments, I really let myself believe. I believed you completely. I let myself hope, really hope, for the first time in years. Even after I freaked out in front of you and hit you, you didn't push me away. You sat right there and told me that I wasn't broken, that I was special and I belonged. Then you died, and I don't know what to believe now, except you're gone again, and I'm still here. Alone. I bet Gabe could even make golf fun. This thing's been up here a while. Isn't that Steph's old band? You could stay here too. I wouldn't try to stop you. Yeah, good. I'll be the only trans person in a town with a population of like four. That sounds like a blast for me. Thanks for not trying to stop me. I'm sorry, Izzy. It's not you. And it's not the band. I fucking love that shit. But I need to try this. It's just... 
time for something new. I knew it. I knew this would happen eventually. Fucking... See you around, Steph. Time for something new. I know how that feels. Gabe was such a dad. Gabe really loved this place. No birds today. Why look up at the sky, when you could look at a sculpture instead? Things got pretty heated back there. Oh, hey kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. Wanted to apologize. For all of us. We're all grieving, but that's no excuse. It was your brother's wake. And you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble. I appreciate it. That was pretty rough. Although it's hard to imagine a good version of your dead brother's wake. No, there's no good version. Just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. Wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. Anyway, if there's anything I can do, just let me know. I need to talk to Mac. I know he's lying. I just don't know why. Any idea where I can find him? Well, he helps out Eleanor at the flower shop. That'd be the place to start. Thanks. I feel like I should warn you, though. You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for. If you get any at all. Just... Don't pin all your hopes on Mac Loudon. Thanks for looking out for me, but... What else am I supposed to do? I wish I had an answer for you. But... If you get a chance before you go all dirty, Harry, swing by the dispensary. Charlotte wants to see you. And one more thing. I've been meaning to give you this for the last few days, but I didn't want to disturb you up there. It'll get you through that door and the one upstairs. This is your home now, for as long as you'd like. What about rent? I don't want to be a freeloader. Don't worry about that for right now. We'll work out a way for you to earn your keep when the time comes. Thank you. Give him hell.
<laughs> I... I have no idea what to even say to him. If I never saw mining equipment ever again, it'd be too soon. I should put something here. It's the least I can do. I wish we'd had more time. Gabe Chen, smooth criminal. They must have been close. Poor Ethan. Dorks. Courtesy of Haven's favorite DJ, I bet. Maybe I can find something upstairs to put on the memory table. I had an incredible mom. And I decided I wanted to be a ranger. She was the first person I told. She said... She said, You're exactly what these mountains need. Losing someone like that, I guess you never get used to it. Is that Jed without his beard? Gabe would have appreciated having beer at his wake. I bet Gabe would be up here a lot if he wasn't the one taking the pictures. Wonder what I can find up here to add to Gabe's memory table. Getting dressed shouldn't be so hard. And yet. See? I can be a person. Would have been fun to see Gabe crush some sweet powder. Or whatever snowboarders say. Hey, Shushu. Thanks for sticking around. Feels like a million years since that day with Gabe. Hasn't even been a week. to start. Okay, 
that did make me feel a little better. Cape really meant the world to Steph. I wonder how she's really holding up. You're coming downstairs. Glad I have something to add to Gabe's table. He always knew how to get me to smile. Courtesy of Haven's favorite DJ, I bet. I appreciate what you're trying to do for me, Mr. Lucan, but I'm not staying long. And I don't take handouts. Just maybe don't cash that check like right now. Jed, thanks for being there when Gabe needed you. No one could blame me for wanting to drink all my sorrows away. I've only known Jed a few days, but he's got my back better than any care worker ever did. Hopefully, things around here can settle down again. Yeah, that'd be good. Okay, Jed said I might find Mac in the flower shop, but I have time to swing by the dispensary if I want. Okay, this is probably the most haven thing I've seen yet. Bet Pike's really had his work cut out for him these last few days. Hey, Pike. Hey! Um, how are you holding up? Guess I've been better. Yeah, right. Dumb question. Hey, I want you to know I meant what I said back there. Gabe was something else. 
He could bring a smile to my face even on the worst days. Yeah. That's what everyone's been saying. And, uh... When you're ready, I still need to get your statement for the investigation. I think I'll be ready soon. Yeah. Yeah. No rush. Bullshit. We have a right to know what's happening to our jobs. You guys don't think it. I've had eight years of my life, and they can't give me back one simple answer about my job. Typhon doesn't give a shit about anyone. I just still can't wrap my head around it. Someone died? It's a shit situation, but the least they could do is be upfront with us about our job security. Exactly. I just hope the council passes the vote. So, anyone seen Loudon? Not since his shift that night. Poor son of a bitch. <laughs> we should get him a beer sometime. One doctor had me try meditation. I always just fell asleep. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Steph asked me to swing by. She's got to be around here somewhere. Helpful. Gabe was hoping I'd get back into playing. Maybe I will. Looks like Steph might be working on a new project. Another issue of legendary monster hunter Thanor. Everything we've been through together. It's hard to beat breakup music, but maybe I can find something around here to cheer him up. The breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. I can't believe he ordered that record. Fuck. Wait. Chrissy? She's a dog? Val, I just want to be friends. Still going. Maybe I'll get to hear her play sometime. Hey, you posted about a lost dog, right? I think they have her over at Todd's Hardware. Are you serious? Uh, thank you so much. I I'll call them right now. Chrissy's gonna make it back home. I'm glad I could help. I'm glad Gabe convinced her to stay. Oh, thank God. I is she there now? Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Can I pick her up today? Have you talked to Ethan at all? No sweat. Take your time. I'll wait. He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like the one you and Gabe were gonna take him to? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. 
I need your help, though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? So, what do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Cravius looks pretty badass. Go with that. <laughs> All right, then. Oh, I, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. Be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Hey, uh, Haven listeners. That was Phone Tap with their new single. Chrissy's gonna make it back home. I'm glad I could help. Thanks again. Me and Chrissy owe you one. The spring you bet. Just around the corner. Sponsored by Typhon Mining Company. The mission is free. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. She wants me to play a bard. This Guess I'm in. Let's start friends. with my name. Bring your ex. I'm sure it'll be different this time. There's beauty and simplicity. Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. Healing serenade it is. How did I meet Thanor? A wolf and an ogre walk into a bar. Uh, oh god. This LARP thing just might work. Ninth Warden's cool, but not as cool as Thanor. It's sweet, she's planning a whole LARP for Ethan. just want to be friends. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. This has been nice, but I should get back to finding Mac. The Pike, but first, a few announcements. Private mining interests will put their bottom lines before your family's health. You don't say. I might be too close to the issue to have an unbiased opinion, but fuck this. The Spring Festival is just around the corner. Sponsored by Typhon Mining Company. The mission is free this year, so bring Chrissy's gonna bring make it family. back home. I'm bring glad I could help. I'm sure it'll be different this time. It's sweet. She's planning a whole LARP for Ethan. I can't believe he ordered that record. Fuck. 